I'm coming to you from Columbus, Ohio, where I live and work. And my name is Kendra, and I am a summer staff alum of 2019, so just last summer. And I just wanted to share a bit of encouragement for you. Um, so today I'm going to share with you from the book of Philippians. And in the book of Philippians, Paul was writing a letter to the church in Philippi which um, it says that Paul was experiencing a lot of oppression and he appeals to his own life an example of how to respond in hardship with joy and I think that at times during coronavirus sometimes we can feel like we're experiencing some hardships whether it's that we can't go to school or um, teach or enjoy the activities that we're in or if it's that money's a little bit tighter right now because of um, all of the just different ways that coronavirus is affecting the economy and people's jobs and I just wanted to share with you the book of Philippians in the New Testament um, in chapter 2 verses 3 through 8 so it says do nothing out of selfish ambition or vain conceit rather in humility value others above yourselves not looking to your own interests but each to the interests of others in your relationship with one another have the same mindset as Christ Jesus who being in the very nature God did not consider equality with God something to be used to his own advantage. Rather, he made himself nothing by taking the very nature of a servant and being made in human likeness. And being found in appearances as man, he humbled himself by becoming obedient to death, even on a cross. So basically, this passage talks about how we are to not do anything selfish or out of vain conceit and, and humility. Um, exalt others above yourself which those are kind of a lot of big words for a kid and when I was a kid I honestly just liked this passage because it had a lot of big words but when you think about what those big words mean it can actually have a lot of meaning to us as Christians and how we show other people Christ that you can show God's love and to serve a family member or a friend whether it's just writing someone a letter that you know that is a nurse or a doctor working at a grocery store helping a brother or sister out with a chore or it's um checking in with a friend just to see how they're doing